Hello everyone, hope you are doing good. In this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to add products from Printful onto Etsy. The first thing you will need to do, you are going to create an account on both platforms. You can create an account for completely free by simply going onto Printful.com or going onto Etsy.com and then signing up using your email address. Once you have signed up onto Etsy, you are going to go over to your profile pic in the top right hand corner and from there you are going to tap on the drop down menu and then you will select sell on Etsy. After you have selected sell on Etsy, you will realize that a home icon pops up that says shop manager. The next thing you are going to need to do is go back onto printful.com and by now you have already signed up onto Printful so your dashboard will look just like this and you are going to go over to the left hand menu option and you are going to select stores. Once you have selected stores, what I want you to do next is you can see that I have already added my Etsy store but to add an Etsy store all you will need to do is scroll down, tap on choose platform after you have selected choose platform right below Etsy, you are going to tap on connect. Once you have selected connect, it is going to automatically redirect you to the Etsy store that you have created. And all you will need to do is tap on confirm connection. Sorry. After you have done that, again, I am going to go back. So we are going to select stores once more. And from here, I can tap on add product. After you have selected add product, you can now add your first product to Etsy. So for example, you will be led to this page on which you can choose to create a new product and you can select practically anything. Whether you would like to add your design onto a hat, a hoodie, anything at all, you can do it using Printful. So let's say I would like to add my design onto this right here. I'll simply tap on it. Once you have selected it, you'll be redirected to a new dashboard on which you'll be able to upload your design. So you can go over to the left hand menu option, tap on uploads and from there you'll be able to upload your design. You can see the different embroidery file if you would want to do embroidery as you can see right there. But we won't be doing embroidery as you can simply upload a regular design. But for this example, let me select this file that I al already uploaded. So I'm going to tap on apply. And you can see it right there. And by the way, you can create a similar image if you want. You could create it using Canva. Once everything is there like in, you're going to tap on continue in the bottom right hand corner. Then from here, you are going to design your mockups. And the mockups are the images that are going to be placed on your Etsy storefront. You have two options. You can either create custom mockups or you can choose from basic mockups. I prefer to choose from basic mockups, which are the pre designed mockups, as you can see right here. Once you have found a mockup that you like, for example, this one right here, or I could use this one by simply tapping on it, then you are going to tap on continue in the bottom right hand corner. And it is going to carry you to the product page and from here you can see the product description. You can edit it if you want. Then you are going to tap on continue once more. And after you have tapped on continue, you will now be able to set your revenue percentage if you would like to change it from 10%. Also, if you would like to offer free shipping, you can simply toggle it on right there. And if you would like to add a size guide, you can do that. Then you are going to tap on submit to store. And you can see the item is being uploaded to the store. And you can see that also the mockups are being uploaded to your Etsy store. Once they have them been uploaded, I'll Go back into Etsy and show you how it looks. You just have to give it a few seconds or a few minutes sometime. As you can see, the item has now been added. All I'll need to do is tap on Edit in Etsy. Once you have tapped on Edit in Etsy, you will be redirected to the listing page as you can see right here. So you can see it has filled out all of the information. As you can see, the mock-up image. And by scrolling down, you will realize that it has also filled out 
all of the necessary information. So all you'll need to do next, you could tap on add more listing if you would like to add another design or you could tap on do this later. As you can see, the listing has now been uploaded and if you would like to make any changes, all you'll have to do is simply hover over the pick. Then you could tap on the pencil right here. After you have tapped on the pencil, you will be redirected to this page and you can see the mock-up images. You can see them right there. And by scrolling down, you can see that Printful has filled out all of the information. You can see the title has been filled out. All of the necessary information has been filled out as you can see right there. That is the beautiful thing about using Printful. All you'll need to do now is simply tap on save and continue and then enter the different payment options that you would like to offer. Hope you found this tutorial helpful and informative. If you did, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe.